Welcome back to the channel guys. It is me AD some more before so today guys I want to talk to you guys about Feyenoord guys. Feyenoord have officially won the league guys. Eredivisie guys This is an incredible achievement for them and guys we're looking at this right here guys This is only I believe let's go actually look at the trophies. They've won before honors This is only the 16th time they won it and look at the last time they won it, it was 2016 2017 This is the second one they won in the 21st century it is an incredible achievement to see what they've done this season. It's been a fantastic achievement. And I got to get massive credit to Arno Slot. And you look at how dominant they were in the league. Like, they only lost, I think, one game this entire season, which is incredible. They won the league with 79 points, two games to go, and it's incredible. Look at the point gap between them and second place. 11-point gap, 78 goals scored, 28 goals conceded. That is incredible, man. They have the best defense in the league. And that is incredible, man. This is what I call dominant, man. Dominant. And I'm looking at some of these players, man. These players stepped up, man. You know. And Feyenoord, man. I got to give credit to Arno Slot. Arno Slot has done a fantastic job with this team. He's done an incredible job with this team. This team has been so good with him in charge. And there are so many good players we have to look at. You know, I'm looking at players like Santiago Jimenez, who's been amazing this season. You know, they sold, uh, obviously, Sinistera last season. They sold him to, I believe, um, Leeds United. And then obviously look at the um, players. Like let's go look at the uh, the squad, man. Look at the squad. Where's the current squad? Like look at the squad right here. You got Bijo, Bilho, a very good a good shot stopper. Then you have um, Quentin Timber was decent. Danilo or Konkochu, of course the captain of the team is fantastic. Then you have um, then also you have um, who else? As I said, Santiago Jimenez, David Hanko. You know, there's a lot of good players on this team, guys. And it's incredible to see how they how good they have been this season, you know. And let's go look at the top scores, man. Let's go look at the top scores. And they made it uh, to the Europa League uh, quarterfinals. They lost to Roma, who is obviously one of the favorites for the competition. So, you know, you can't really be too critical of them. You know, they, they put up a great performance in Europe this season. So, as you guys can see, let's go look at the, the top goal scores, right? So, um, top goal scores. So, yeah, as you can see, they only lost one game this season, which was to PSV. They haven't even lost a home game, which is incredible. Um, and, yeah, as you can see right here, guys, where is the top scores, play, player details? Where is the top scores? Where is the stats? Um, here we go, total. I don't really like how they did this thing. Okay, this is, should be how it should be done. Okay, so the top goal scorers have been Santiago Jimenez with 22 goals, Orko Kocha with 12, then you got Danilo Pereira with 12. Sebastian got what 10 and yeah, man. So like I said, man, Alariza Jahan Bakash, forgot about him. He's also chipped in a, quite a few amount of goals. And they scored 107 goals this season, guys. 107 goals this season, guys. Very, very good, man. Got to give huge props to this team. And they're going to be in the Champions League next season, guys. They'll be in part one as well for the draw. Let's see what they could do in the Champions League. Hopefully, they could keep some of their best players this season, guys, because I really want to see like how Santa Jimenez can do. I want to see how Kochu can do in Europe, man. And who knows? possibly a quarterfinals of the Champions League next season if things go their way obviously that's a very much um <laughs> dream scenario but um let's hope they can at least advance out of the group so I want to know what you guys think in the comments below guys we got to celebrate this achievement guys and in a few hours from now hopefully we'll be able to celebrate Barcelona win La winning La Liga so like I said guys there will be a live stream later today so remember guys to like this video if you did enjoy subscribe if you're new on here comment below your thoughts comment section below remember guys to become a member of the channel I recently uploaded a members video Turn on vacations to be notified. Also, check out my platform. Listen to the description below. And I'll see you guys later. Peace out.